Hey friends, welcome and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will show you step by step on how to create this flyer design using Pizzler application. Pizzler is a great application to use for graphic design. So if you're really interested in learning this, then make sure to give this video a big thumbs up right now and also subscribe to my channel. That is if you're new here. Alright, once you've done that, let's get right into today's tutorial. Okay, so once we've opened the Pizzler application, what we're going to do now is to change our image size so i come over here and click image size then i'm just going to reduce this to 1000 okay then after that i'm just going to click okay the next thing i'm going to do now is to change the background i'll come over here right then i click on color then i'm just going to use a black background okay so for now let's just delete this text over here okay once we have done this the next thing i'm going to do now is to create uh, a shape all right then i'm just going to reduce radius to 100 percent all right after that i'm just going to reduce this and put it in the middle Okay, after I've done that, we're going to create a copy of the circle. And then we're just going to reduce this one here. We're going to reduce the size. Alright, then we're just going to put it over here. Alright, then we'll create another copy of that one. And bring it down here. All right. So after I've done this, what I'm going to do now is to just add images to the circle so we click on the circles and we're just going to just go to texture we click on the image icon So we just do the same thing for the remaining two circles. After we have done this, we're just going to add stroke to the circles. So I come over to stroke and I click enable. And I'm just going to use red. Alright, then I'm also going to add stroke to the remaining circles. But I'm going to use um, yellow for this one. Okay, so after we've done after we've done this, what we're going to do next is to create a text. Alright, this one right here, we're just going to double click and change it to the name of the brand. And I'm just going to change the font. And I also change the color. Alright, 
Alright, then after that I create an alert text. Okay, after we have done that, we're going to change the font. And I'm just going to change the color also to yellow. Alright, after we have done that, the next step is to create uh, a circle. Alright, we're going to increase the radius to 200. Then I'm going to reduce the opacity. Alright, then after that, I'm just going to increase stroke width. Let's increase it to about. 11 then we're going to change the color of the stroke right then after that you create another circle then we're just going to change it to red and we're going to reduce it and put it in red yeah something like that then after I've done that, we're going to join this one, the red and the yellow, um, yellow stroke. So just this and this. All right. Yeah, I'm just going to reduce this and pull it. Put it right there. Then after I've done that, we create another copy. Use the opacity and change it to yellow. Alright, then after I've done that, we are going to create a shape. We click on triangle. This. Alright, then I change the color to yellow. I reduce this a little. Put it right here. Then I create another copy. Now increase this one size a little and change the color to red. Alright, so after I've done that, we're just going to join the two triangles together. Then we're going to reduce the size. Then we're just going to put it over here. Okay, so. Once we've done that, create another circle. All right, then we we'll click on yellow. I'm just going to take this 
like this on this side and then we create another copy we change it to we change it to red all right and we're just gonna put it over here okay so after we have done that we create another shape we change this to yellow all right we're just going to increase it and just bring it down here okay so let's just remove this now after we have done all this the next step is to create a text. So we'll bring it right here. Okay, once I've done that, we change the font. Alright, and I'm just going to do this and put it there. Alright, then I'm just going to change the color. So, for the we sell best, I'm going to use white. Alright, then. For quality, we're just going to change the color to yellow. Okay, so once we have done that, we create another text. Seems to follow like a shadow, dark and cold to the touch. Am I insane not to let go? All right, after you've made sure you've arranged everything like I just did, what I'm going to do now is just to import the social media icons. So I just come to import. By the way, as you guys know, the link. To download the materials I use for any of my design is always in the description section of the video. So the materials I use for this flyer design, the link to download them is in the description section of this video. Just to remind you guys. Then after we have done that, we're just going to import this. Alright, then I reduce this and just click OK. Then after I've done, I'm just going to reduce the size. Okay, then after I've done that, I create a copy. Then I move to another social media icon.
Okay, after we're done that, we're just going to report. We're going to um, create a text. Alright, double click. Then I'm going to change the font. And we're going to change the color to red. And we're going to reduce the size. Okay, then I create a copy. So we are actually done. So once you have done this, then what you are going to do now is just click on this save icon which is over here. Then you can save it as a project if you want and you can also save it as image. So we click on save as image, then we are just going to click save to gallery. So once you do that, it will be saved on your phone. So yeah, that's all for today's tutorial i hope this video was helpful if this was helpful make sure to give it a like that is if you haven't and also share with someone who you feel may find the video helpful and if you are new to my channel you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe right now so you can see more videos like this thank you guys so much i will see you guys in the next video